everyone and welcome to my new dolly paint video and today guys we're going to give a makeover to this big Elsa styling hat you know I've customized lots of monster high and rainbow high dolls lately and today I feel rather like having fun with another Disney princess big styling hat I've already repainted Ariel, Jasmine, Moana was there some somebody else? Maybe. So and now it's time to repaint Elsa. I really love this collection of dolls because they really look like Disney princesses for, from the movies. Like this Elsa really looks like Elsa from the cartoon with her huge eyes, with her tiny little bit sharper nose and also a little bit thinner lips. She really looks like Elsa and today I will try to make her look more realistic. I will try to make this Elsa doll look like a real girl or I will try at least. <laughs> Hopefully it's gonna work. Uh, and I actually really like this doll. I really love her outfit. This is probably the first time I see actually sculpted outfit, not just some paint printed on top of it. So it's nice. So let's unbox this doll. Let's see first of all her hair quality. This is the most interesting part for me. Yeah, and also let's take a look at all these accessories and let her face a little bit closer. And don't forget to subscribe, guys, and hit the bell button and hit the like button. You know, all these YouTube things are very important. Sorry for being annoying. But anyway, do. Do the YouTube things. And let's start the transformation. So, this is the doll from up close. Everything is pretty regular. The standard set of accessories. I really love that these accessories are also frozen themed. But I guess they're always made to match the character. She also has a very regular hair quality for this type of dolls, like there is not that much hair to be honest. And the only special and unusual thing about her is probably her outfit. I'm really impressed they made it real and not just painted on, on top of the body. So now let's wipe off her face with pure acetone, spray it with Mr. Super Clear and then I will start drawing. This pink paint on her lips left a serious stain, but anyway, it's okay. I will paint my new lips on top of these ones, and I even think that this lighter pink color looks better on her than that very bright pink that she used to have. has a very light and cold skin tone but I will first apply all the shades using my bronzy soft pastels and then later I will make it all colder and lighter with very light magenta and also with some white soft pastels.
Eliza wears purple eyeshadows and I really love that they look super icy. I want to try to recreate this icy effect as well. to add some more blush to her cheeks in the end because Elsa has pink cheeks and a pink nose from cold weather. It looks very natural on her. Elsa has some freckles on her cheeks. They're not super visible but they are there so I want to give freckles to my doll as well. So this is where I've ended up with her face so far and now I'm going to take this iridescent paint and I will spray a thin layer of it kind of all over her face because I want her to have this super icy look. And then add more of this paint to her eyelids.
So this is her face and I think she looks absolutely beautiful. So icy, really super pretty. This iridescent paint is a real gem. So now let's paint her outfit and after this we will style her hair. Well, Elsa wears a long and beautiful braid, but I'm not sure if I have enough hair to make anything like this, but anyway, I will try, I will really do my best. what I've made. I don't know, it doesn't look bad at all considering the amount and the length of her hair. So now let's attach false lashes, add gloss to her eyes and lips and then I'll take a look at the end result pictures. Oh, and I also want to add some snow to the white part of her dress. So guys, this is my finished Elsa. To be honest, I was a little bit worried about her face because her face proportions look very cartoonish and I wasn't sure if my kind of more realistic style of drawing would work well this time. But now I'm really happy because she looks perfectly realistic. You could perfectly imagine a girl looking like her in real life. I really love her icy purple eyeshadows and also her icy skin. 
I think she's absolutely beautiful. She's really like a real life Elsa. I really hope you guys enjoy this kind of makeovers here on my channel. The next week there will be a huge doll makeover and I think it will be the coolest one ever. I just hope I will be able to finish it on time because it's gonna be really another level, you will see. And now please tell me what you think about my Elsa makeover. I really hope you like her and if you want to get her into your house you can check my eBay. She is now there available for sale for three days and the link you can find the description box under this video. So guys, and that was my doll transformation of the week. I really hope you've enjoyed it today. And if so, please don't forget to support my art here on YouTube with your likes. Of course, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button to get notified about my new doll repaint video. And I will see you again next week on Friday. Yeah, so see you soon. Have a nice weekend. Love you guys. Bye.